All right. Um, ESPN dropped their new women's uh, power ranking or pound for pound ranking. And uh, it has some of the usual suspects on it. Top three, uh, Shields, well, uh, actually Taylor Shields, Serrano, McCaskill. I mean, the usual suspects. And um, what I found very interesting is the absence of Savannah Marshall. Now, a lot of people consider Savannah Marshall one of the best fighters in the world, especially, you know, overseas, British, whatever. And uh, she didn't get that much consideration, really at all, when you look at uh, at the, the voters. I think maybe only like two people, maybe three, even included her in it. Like, she didn't get much, <laughs> much consideration at all by the voters. And, um... Uh, I was wondering, was she, was, she, was she snubbed? Was she overlooked? Is she underrated? Some people might say she's overrated. How would you place Savannah Marshall when it comes to some of the best fighters in the world? Now, clearly, she's one of the better, in my opinion, anyway, middleweights slash super middleweights. I would definitely put her in the upper echelon of that group, but what about pound for pound? Now, I know what the detractors are going to say. They're going to say, well, hold up, Doc, who is Savannah Marshall for to put her on a pound for pound list? Who has Savannah Marshall fought? Really, period. And the Savannah Marshall now, her supporters will probably say, well, you know, she she convincingly beat Hannah Rankin. Matter of fact, she stopped Hannah Rankin, something that Clarissa Shields couldn't do, even though Clarissa Shields did dominate her. And they will also say probably Maria uh, Lindbergh. Those are probably her most notable victories. Now, how much weight you will put behind that I guess that would depend on who's the person that's talking. Like like me personally, I think Hannah Rankin is a good fighter, but I don't think she's one of the top. She's a she's a she's a good boxer, but she's not one of the top women boxers today. And uh, Maria Lindbergh, in my opinion, well, uh, to me that that's that's not saying too much. Matter of fact. Clarissa Shields' opponent, the one she's fighting January 29th, she actually has a victory over Maria Lindbergh as well. So, I mean, that hold a little weight, but my point is, I think when you look at Savannah Marshall, you can't really necessarily go off of who she beat because her resume is a little meager. It is it's limited. It's not what it should be, but... I think you can you can do the eye test and tell she's a good fighter. But because of that, I can understand why nobody really put her in the top. I mean, she had a couple votes, but I can understand. And that was like for eighth and ninth place. But I can understand why she's not really on most people pound for pound radar. But uh, if her and Clarissa Shields both take care of business, I think both of them had like tune-up fights coming up uh, late late winter then they'll be going at it this spring. But until then, unless she beats Clarissa Shields or if they push it back a little further, unless she, she wind up getting more belts under her waist, I don't see her being in the top. I mean, because most of these girls that you see in the top pound for pound list are multiple title holders. You know, McCaskill, uh, Shields, even with Amanda Serrano, you know, she might not have you know, she might not be undisputed. That girl done went up and down and won belts in seven different divisions. These girls are putting the work. Savannah Marshall got more work to do. And that's pretty much all I got. This hair Buster Boxes on Fight Doctor. Hit that like button. Hit that share button. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell. Hit me up in the comment section. Let me know, do you feel like Savannah Marshall is being underrated? Do she belong in the top ten 
powerful women's powerful powerless or do you feel like she's overrated and I guess she'll be getting exposed soon if you feel that way but that's pretty much all I got this hair busting boxes on fight dr. I am out